Hi guys, it's DJ War Productions one here. Um, I got my bug out bag here. Actually, my second one. I have four bug out bags. I can already said that. Um, this is the second one I made. This is my medical kit one. But this is gonna last you quite a while. This looks like your real. This looks like your real preppers bug out bag. This is what it should look like. Oh, okay, you want a string one nice backpack? Um, that's just just a school backpack. But check it out, man. It's looking nice. It's looking professional. Let me take this off real quick. I'm sorry. I just want to put that there temporary. Let me find the. That looks nice. Oops. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, there you go. So if we had an extra person in the family and they met us up and we're like, oh hey, do you have a bugger bag? No, um, you can take this small one. So yeah, my profile. What? Small one. Okay. My sister. Okay. My sister got a like this. What points get sick? Ooh, that hurts. Okay, for 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 right here. Let's get cracking down the business and uh, show you what's in it, or what's on the outside. So, what is in my bucket bag? Not what, what's on is these little bottles of water. I already did a review on these kind of my Coleman emergency blanket. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to be as serious as I can. Here. Uh, get, uh, get my knife right here, six inch wide, I'm gonna keep that right there, get a flashlight, and the way this is angled, I just noticed this about five minutes ago, is if you did that somehow, if you put something right here, like right there, you can angle it. Wait, it shows right in front of you, but it probably wouldn't show around your shoulder, so. Yeah. So there's that. I'm gonna take that out here. And we got a fire starter right here. Everybody should have some. But of course, a lot of people prefer matches, but I don't know. Whatever. So let's uncook this. That makes it very sturdy. Take this off real quick and see. This will easily come off once you. Uh, well, not easily, easily, but no, it'll come off once um you get this on hooks. So, yeah, show what's up. Right here we have my and this is kind of hygiene stuff. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. You can have a bottle right here and um heat it up. And this is my mini shower, portable shower. Made from hand. Or an axe bottle. And uh, here you put a jug next to it. And since it's black, it will heat it up. So, yeah, there's that. And we get a pair of jogging pants in there. Why jogging pants? I forget. But it's a Campbell's chicken noodle soup in there. Um, I mean, once you need extra pants, you gotta have extra pants. Maybe you got wet or something. Maybe you have mud on them. And that's gonna cause a pretty bad rash. So you need change in and out. Just hope it's not cold. Um. So that's it for the deaf, the dead up center. Or the middle. Wait a minute. And then the side one. Yeah. Sorry, guys, am I getting lazy on you? I'm not showing you. What do we get? What do we get in here? Oh, lots of stuff. Um, Vietnam bandages. And uh, seeds. Lots of um, lots of seeds. Who knows how long you're gonna be out there? Maybe you need to grow some food. Got another fire starter. Oh, boy. 
Okay, my first door and get my survival whistle right here. Compass, match holder, whistle, um, mirror signal, or signal mirror, and fire starter. And does it up for that one? It says one. Oh, no. No. I forgot. Sorry about that. And on the other side, what is this? Cliffhanger. Well, Cliffhanger, you make some pretty good backpacks. I will tell you that much. Oh. Yeah, sorry. Look down. Take a look. Get a top ramen. Get a five pack of these for a one dollar at Dollar Tree. Buying a bunch more tomorrow. Doing a vlog. Get a new nice pair and smell of socks. Always a good thing to have extra pair of socks. When your feet get wet, bad things happen. Not good. Don't your feet get wet. You are talking about some bad stuff right there. Pretty bad. So, so far we could survive out a day or so. And here is where, ow, I got hurt. Okay, let me just pull out this massive medical box. This is all, all my medical stuff. Oh. Ah. Oh, we are getting to that way. I got some knee pads. Not just one. But, yeah. More knee pads. Got to go back to Um. Ooh, got a second flash right here. I gotta shut that again. Got a little granola bar. Or Nature Valley. A high energy. Just so you guys don't think I pulled out the same knee pad. So. Depend on where you're going. That's what I just put out. Uh, more top ramen chicken. Why do I have so much ramen? Because it's cheap and it gives you lots of nutrients and protein. Uh, has vegetables and um, meat. So you got your protein too. And I know this is kind of sound kind of stupid. I know. Um, I'm packing up more tomorrow. Um, I only got one bottle of water in here, but when I kind of put it in here, I kind of was like, you know, I don't have much water bottles, I need one for everybody, and now I'm starting up on water. So there's that. Mm -hmm. What us gets to Z? Box of Z Magical. Blades. Hey, how's it going? I kind of probably get a close up. I'll get the good stuff. Get some food right here, like oatmeal, uh, and chocolate, uh, hot cocoa mix. So water fresheners. Get obviously big family. So I just take this over here, so you guys don't think I'm lying about anything. Get my big band-aids. Poncho. For obvious, re obvious reasons. Same as um, using one of these for shelter, um, signal mirror, whatever. Some nose fry. Get, um, actually I'm just going to do this real quick. Show you, see you, all this stuff. Get some, uh, gauze. Uh, what's this in here? Oh, this helps you go to sleep. So if you got somebody injured, you could put them in the car or wherever you're sleeping. Sleep bag, um, help them go to sleep better, get better. Get lots of tooth toothpaste, soap for hygiene. I don't know why I have um bullet shells in there. Okay, go sit. Hey, we're over here. You gotta get it. Hey, this is where I need you guys to pick this guy up. He's hurt. Get some sunscreen. This is fifty dollars right here. This is dead up. No joke. I don't know how. 
Um, this is poison ivy stuff. Cow dry. Cow dry. Some body moisturizing cream. Got some earplugs right here. Just, you never know. Whatever. More soap. Lots and lots and lots of and lots of alcohol swabs. I forget what these are. I think that's just for scars. Uh, who can forget Kleenexes? Mm, no, we got some mouthwash down here. Uh, yeah, degree stuff. And so yeah, that's uh, basically it. Oh, okay, something else. Uh, lip balm. You don't want your lips to get lips to get checked while you're out there. That stuff. Gauze bags. Because obviously you probably want those if you got gauze. Gauze. I think gauze, I, I don't exactly know what gauze is supposed to do for you. My brother would know. I think it's for like once you spray in your toe or something. Whatever, somebody tell me. Before I go nuts about it. Go, go, go for gauze balls. Do I need another medical kit? Yes. Am I a real prepper? Do I take this stuff serious? Yes. My family is looking at me. That's why. Prep. It's your economic class. Gotta get it, sir. Whatever you guys want to prep for, that's your choice. I just do it for the economic class. So remember, you guys. Oh, but remember guys, I'm doing vlog tomorrow evening, buying lots of water, and this is just opened up, and something's not right in there, there we go, close, I bought this box for 50 cents, and now it's James Ford with Mechabee's box, good for me, DJ, good for me. Okay. So, yeah. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, me and my friend Eli is making a YouTube channel. I do believe his name is going to be Eli Retro, something like that. Something similar. I don't know. Uh, we're doing some army training vehicle for videos. We do deployments off bikes. Um, we do gun training. We do crawling, walking, sniper training. Um, so yeah, so you guys can follow along, you know, do whatever. Hope you guys learned something too. So yeah, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. See so, yeah. ya, long video. See <laughs> so, ya. Yeah.